What's going on? Back again for another video. Jacob's here with us this time. Say hi. Hi. We're going to do something a little bit different. We're not going to be doing hot sauce today. We're going to be doing chips from Packy. Um, I've collected, I believe they have five different uh, flavors. I have found four that I can buy in local stores around me. Uh, of course, right now they do have the uh, challenge or the uh, the contest where you can win a couple of uh, the Carolina Reaper chips, so the one chip challenge. Um, as of right now, I have three of these coming, and we're going to do all of them in one video for you guys. I have lined them up from what I believe to be the the least hot to the hottest, which is starting with the uh, cool salsa verde or the spicy queso, the grilled habanero, and the haunted ghost pepper chip. Yeah, I know that's the hottest. Well, the, 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 the hottest, hottest is the Carolina Reaper chip, but they don't sell that one right now. But that's the hottest out of all of these. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. Yes, it's definitely ghost. Now, normally I will uh, read off the ingredients list. Um, they do have this no artificial ingredients list. I don't know much about chips, so I don't know what's artificial, what's not artificial, what's natural, what's not natural. And I'm not going to bore you with reading off that list. That list is insane. Alright, so for the cool salsa verde, light crispy chips meet fresh salsa verde and cool sour cream. It's the sort of a beautiful friendship, or it's the start of a beautiful friendship. One taste, and you'll agree, you better get two bags next time. I know where to buy these, so if they are good, I know where to get another bag. It smells like fresh salsa. 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 It doesn't smell like the store brand salsa. If you're making fresh salsa in your house, chopping up onions and tomatoes and stuff, it smells just like that. You go first. See if it's any hot or what. These shouldn't be too hot. It should be like a one on the heat level. No hot. No hot? Good chip? Do you like these these better or do you like uh, Doritos better? These better. These better? I like the Packy chips. They make a uh, very good brand of chips. Um, very tasteful. Um, I have not had the salsa or the grilled habanero yet. Ooh. So these are both uh, new to me. Spicy? When you kind of like put it on your lip. <laughs> if this one's spicy, you wait until what's to come. That is like having your chips and salsa all in one bag. You want, a, one. You want another one? <laughs> they're not hot. No, they're not hot at all. I, I wouldn't even consider them a one on the heat level. But, uh, that's your, your chips and salsa right in a bag. You don't have to, no mess with the bowls and making salsa and stuff like that. Oh. Um, it's not too overpowering with salt. A lot of chips are overpowering with salt. This is a 190 milligrams per serving, which is a five and a half. No, it's 10 chips per serving. Uh, excellent product. I will definitely uh, be buying more of those. I'm in here. Yeah. Mostly just me, right? <laughs> So the next one, we have Spicy Queso. And I will be entering in these codes. Hopefully maybe I can win another uh, another Carolina Reaper chip. And we can have four in one day. However many chips I win, um, we're going to do an entire video. I'm going to uh, eat them all in a row. See how many I can get through. I, I can get a piece of him. <laughs> a piece of it. A piece of the chip? Yeah. I don't know. 
All right, let's see. Sorry, I opened this one up a little early. Uh, spicy, uh, spicy queso. Spicy jalapeno and chipotle say thank you cheese. Made with real cheddar cheese and spices. These chips are a light and crispy ode to golden queso. Fire up your taste buds and dig in. Uh, now these ones are the same, same salt content as the other ones. I would put these ones, they don't have a, uh, I've had these before. They don't have a heat, a, like a hot, hot heat to them, but they do have like a spice to them. Here you go, I couldn't find a smaller chip. What does it taste like to you? Just like Doritos, but salsa a little bit. Salsa a little bit? We can taste in that queso in it. Ugh. Is it spicy? No. It's yeah. disgusting. You don't like it? <laughs> so he doesn't like the spicy queso ones. I have to eat it. You don't have to eat it? You don't want it? I don't want it. You don't like it, but you'll eat the chip. <laughs> That makes absolutely no sense, guys. All right. <coughs> now, these chips are exactly like eating chips and queso. Like a really, really good queso. It's not a spiciness to it, but you can taste that it is a spice. Um, just like queso has. Queso is not a hot thing to eat, but it does have like that, that spice flavor to it. Um, right off the bat, you get extraordinary amount of cheese flavor and it's a good cheese flavor. It's not like a cheese whiz flavor. And then you get that queso, just like you're dipping right into queso and eating it. Uh, once again, very good, uh, uh, product there. I love these chips so far. Um, can't wait to see what else they come out with. I guess we're, uh, you're one and one. You don't like one and you like one, right? <laughs> oh, no. Now we get to the, the spicier ones. Now, I just noticed this. On the back of these things, does say no artificial ingredients, no artificial flavors, no preservatives, gluten free, GMO free, free of just about anything that a lot of people consider bad for them nowadays. Um, I have not had these yet, so I will uh, go over the heat level after. Uh, grilled habanero, light, crispy, and bursting with real grilled habanero flavor. These chips are not messing around. They bring the holy grail of heat. Hey, Mouth, come get your whooping. <laughs> I think uh, Jacob's going to eat all my salsa verde chips. All right, let's dig in. Uh, these are 180 milligrams of sodium per 10 chips. So a little bit less. Not much at all. Uh-oh. I ripped the bag in half. Now surprisingly, what do you smell? Fresh salt. Surprisingly, they don't have much smell to them. All the other chips, you can smell exactly what they would taste like. They don't have a whole lot of uh, smell to them. Which probably, I'm thinking they'll probably have a heat. They probably want to make the comeback for it. You want me to go first, or you going first on this one? You going first. Okay, last two first. Now, unlike the other ones, um, it's not like a queso or a salsa. It's just a habanero and a chip. So it doesn't have a ton of flavor. Um, I'd probably rate these on the lowest end of actual flavor. Um, the heat level on them is maybe a three or so. What do you think on the heat level? Was it hot or not so hot? A little bit. A little bit. Not as hot as I thought they would be. 
for the grilled habaneros. I figured you'd get at least a, a four or five out of them. Um, you eat a whole bag that's starting to get hot. Um, honestly, mildly, mildly disappointed in the uh, flavor and the heat on these ones. Um, the other ones, though, have been great products. Now for the last one, the haunted ghost pepper ones. No. Jacob's actually had these once before. My and, brother uh, has them too. Yeah. And, oh. They wanted to try one of the hot chips after I did my first one chip challenge. Um, so they wanted to try them. They had a little taste of them. Uh, it was a hilarious reaction <laughs> to say the least. Okay, so haunted ghost pepper, light, crispy, and freaking hot. Witness the haunted, haunted ghost pepper, the scariest of them all. These chips will terrify your taste buds. Ours are still hiding under the bed. All right, these are do. 190 milligrams of sodium per 10 chips. So just like the other, the first two. That's what I should do. With those hide up, hide under the bed. No, hide those. Under my bed. Hide these ones under your bed? You can have them. No, Alright, and this one also has a code, so we'll be entering that one in after the video to see if it, uh, see if this one's a winner too. Alright. I'm just ripping every bag. I do not know how to open up bags. I'm the worst bag opener. Smells like straight heat. Now I've had these. These are a hot chip. Uh, for comparing them to chips, there's not a lot of hot chips out there, and they did a very good job with this being a chip that you could eat the whole bag from start to fur or start to finish. Uh, I don't think you could eat a whole bag though. But nope. it is a great flavor chip. You want a whole chip, or you want that one? <laughs> I'm gonna take a whole one. Now I these ones here I eat on a daily basis. I probably get two bags a day of these ones. You eating them without me? Sorry. I hope you burn your taste buds off. <laughs> <laughs> um, these are a great chip all around, everyday chip. Uh Right now, I believe they, uh, I'm here in Florida, so they only sell them in, uh, in 7-Elevens for me. But they're probably every 7-Eleven uh, you could find. Is it hot? You don't have to eat the rest of the chip if you don't want to. It's about 50 degrees outside right now, so this should warm him up. He's been complaining that he's cold this whole time. All right, here we go. If kids are watching this video, do not eat those. <laughs> they are a pretty hot chip. Here. You don't have to eat the rest of that one. I am. <laughs> You're not going to survive to the next video. Everybody say bye, Jacob. He's going to melt after this video. Um, with these chips, you get an instant heat with it. Um, there's not a whole bunch of flavor to it, but it is a very hot chip, and that, that's what I love. I just love extremely hot chip just to make sure my mouth's still alive. Oh gosh. Um, if you're going for flavor, definitely go with the first two, the nacho, or the spicy queso, or the uh, sal cool salsa verde. Great flavors on those chips. Um, no heat to them. So you'll be fine all day long. I wouldn't recommend the grilled habanero. That bag's probably going to sit around for a while. I'm kind of disappointed in it. If you want something to make sure that you uh, you feel alive and you can't get your hands on the uh, Carolina Reaper chip, eat a whole bag of these. What I do is I just crush up the whole bag and just drink or pretty much eat them right out of the bag. You get more that way, more heat. Uh, also, guys, remember... Share any of my videos and comment on any video. Comment on any of them, comment whatever you want. You'll be entered in to win the Carolina Reaper sauce. Uh, 
contest is going through until February 1st when I'm going to draw all the names and I don't know if he or one of my kids are going to draw the names out of a bag. Thank you and I'll see you guys in the next one.